I started drawing Haida designs when I was probably in grade three. Yeah, I started pretty young. Um, I, I think it was after my first um, fishing um, excursion with my grandfather when I was probably six years old. And it was, we went to the west coast of Haida Gwaii and, and it was after that I really um, just felt I, f I just started drawing Haida designs and fishing boats. <laughs> That's all I, I ever thought about. My first um, piece, the thing I actually got paid for in the art world was from Bill Reed. And he, he did a, a pencil drawing on a, the inside of a new seine boat that was one of my mom's friends. She was good friends with Bill as well. And, she brought Bill down to her friend Byron's brand new seine boat and Bill sketched a killer whale in the galley wall and he asked me to paint it for him and I was really nervous and I was quite young at the time and, and um, he said to me, you're Haida, aren't you? <laughs> Do it. So, so I painted that design and it was the first thing I ever got paid for as an artist. But, yeah, well, he was, he did such a huge amount of work. Um, he was hugely influential for me and, and for all Haida artists, I think, because he pushed things to a whole new level with, um, especially with when it came to his jewelry techniques and, and the repose work, which I really fell in love with. Since I was young, I was always inspired by my uncle's creations, like ever since I was super little, and I've always been quite creative. Um, it wasn't until we started screen printing uh, when I was like 14 that I started creating my own art. And then um, in 2017, me and my uncle worked on my first panel together. So that's when it kind of started. Yeah, I'm really grateful and, and I'm really proud of her, her advancement in the art world. Like she's. I'm learning from her now <laughs> when it comes to carving wood in some ways. So like, it's really great. And I'm, I, I'm really happy that she can be a part of it because she's really showing me some amazing things. And, and uh, as you can see, she's got quite good. So. I mean, pretty much every design I start to design, when it's almost finished, I get him to check it over and make sure everything's right, because there's a lot of rules and um, a lot of things that have to be right with Haida Art, and to make sure, you know, ovoids are the right size and all these things, so he uh, always kind of double checks my designs before I start uh, working on a project just to make sure it's following proper uh, form. Primarily I have my metal work here because that's mainly what I do. I, you know, my niece is doing more wood carving now than I have in my entire career, to be honest. But um, I have a little bit of different things here. Most of the, uh, quite a few of the pieces were for our feast. They were created especially with our family feast in mind, like the copper shield, and the, the front, the chief's frontlet that I did, those are um, gifted to my brother-in-law, Andy, and um, it was part of a dowry I had to give to Andy and his family for marrying my sister. So um, a lot of these objects were used um, in our feast last year in Haida Gwaii. 